Hi there. Yep, it's Sue Stamp here with you. Um, it is March 31st, but I am doing a video on my April workshop in the mail. So you can see what they look like and how to put them together. Uh, this is the first one, and this uses the stamp set uh, that was in our uh, celebration, and it's the corner bouquet. And there are two bouquets in this uh, set and this one is the larger and this is a little smaller and then hello friend is from another stamp set and what I did was I have the black card base and then you take the three layers of the white like so and you stamp them so that they are, put all three pieces together, and then you stamp it. And it's gonna come out like this. There's gonna be a space in between there because you have the paper cut and where that line is, it's not gonna print. So you end up with a space in there. And that's perfect because that's where these will fit in. So there's two of these. There's one here and one behind here. And then of course the card itself is the other. Now, before you put these together with the black, you're going to take two different colors of ink and you're going to sponge these on. You can sponge them or you can use daubers or you can use the blending brushes. Uh, whatever you choose to use, you're going to just do it across here. I did, um, it doesn't show up real good on the camera here, but I did a granny apple green real light on the bottom. And then on the top, I have Pool Party. So there are two different colors. I left it kind of white in the middle, and that's where I made that stamp that stamp at. So that is the first card. Yay. And I love the different layers. I think that's always a fun thing whenever you can focus on multiple layers on a card. Whoops, and this is the inside because it's a black card base. You've got to have a white on the inside or you couldn't write your sentiment very easily. <laughs> and this is another set. Now, I'm kind of sad about this set because it's being retired. And it's called a Little Lace. And you can see it has a die cut. And on this one, I cut the die cut at the circle point. And so it made a scallopy bottom. And on the bottom here, I... Uh, stamped in just a little note to say hello. Now this is a stamp set that coordinates with this die and again it's called a little lace and I took the middle inside here. This is seaside spray so I used my blends and colored the inside of that card and then this is the ribbon uh, that you could have purchased previously. I, I don't know if, any, if that's available in this color. The seaside spray I think is one of them that sold out pretty quick. So that's that card and all you're going to do for it is you're going to glue your lace on and I just put random dots here where the thicker points are and then you square it up at the top and scallop ends up here. Now I put the flower on with dimensionals and like I say I did color those in and this piece here um, one piece goes around the flower piece and the other one just gets a knot tied in it. So I just run that behind there and tie a little knot. I call those my faux bows because <laughs> they're not quite real bows, but they do look like a bow, kind of, so, a small bow. So that's card number two. And for card number three, we have a little bit of brightness here. This is one of my favorite sets called Art Gallery, and I just love the way this flower looks. And this is on Grapefruit Grove, which is one of our retiring colors. And the leaves are pear pizzazz, and I have a ribbon to match that, white on the inside, and it just says best wishes in the same pear pizzazz. So that's one that you'll be able to get together. And then the last one, this is so cute, I love this. Um, the whale set is also retiring, I believe. And this fold um, is a little bit unique. This folds back whenever it opens, 
And so it still is gonna fit into a standard A2 size envelope, which is what this one is. So when it's in here, it fits right in. Now there's a little piece of vellum in here that is just the splash, and I put that coming out of the top of the whale. And it says, whale done. <laughs> Cute set. And uh, I love the colorful DSP that goes with this. Now everyone will be getting different DSPs to go on their card because this the set has multiple ones. And as an example, this is one here. And it has the turtles. And I want to apologize because for some reason, my printer, when I did the instruction sheet, it looks like this, the printer was all gaga or something, I don't know. But it printed with no color and it printed big white lines through everything. So I did get it fixed before I did the other ones, but whenever you get this, you're gonna notice that the actual uh, instruction sheet is not printed very prettily. Prettily, is that a word? <laughs> So that is our workshop in the mail for April of 2021. And I appreciate you joining me this month and look forward to having you with us again next month. The, uh, the new catalog is gonna go live in May. So I'll be placing some orders in April. And if you're interested and wanna place orders early, you can join Stamping Up. Uh, no obligation to continue. Um, you get a $125 credit of merchandise that you choose for $99, and you get the new catalog, and you can purchase the uh, pre-order items. So if you're interested, let me know. You can always reach me. My store is suestap.stampinup.net. My email is suestap1 at gmail, and my website is suestap.com. So, uh... If you need me, get a hold of me. I'd love to hear from you. And good luck with your cards this month. I think you'll enjoy them. They are nice and colorful, and we're all ready for a dose of spring, I think. So happy stamping. Bye for now.